Who doesn't love a little seven random rips? We got nothing to add. Let's just dive into some packs. We are going to let the dice decide what we're pulling. We're going to start where we left off. And uh, we rolled a one right off the bat. So we're taking this first pack. And we've got 23-24 Hobby of MVP. I believe the Redemptions are still alive. That's what we're going to go after. Try to get some Connor Bedard content out of this. It's been a little while since we've seen Bedard. I'd like to pull something of him in this seven random rips. Let's see here. We'll pull things around. We've got Jordan Cairo, UC Saras, Tori Krug, Matthew Barzell, Gabrielle Landeskog, Kaspari Kapanen, Chris Letang in the ice battles. And back here, we've got MVP talent, 86. That's going to be uh, Jack Hughes, right? Yes. Jack Hughes in the, uh, in the insert there, MT70. Very nice. Okay, rolling right along. We're getting into pack number two. We rolled a six. We're getting the large numbers here now. We got one. Let me make some room here. Two, three, four, four, five, and six. We've got, ooh, Nostalgia 2001 Prism. I believe this is McDonald's. Yeah, so McDonald's back here. And we've got some pack odds here. Platinum variations are one and four. Checklists are every pack. Ooh, the dial of stats are cool. I love that one. 1 in 16. Glove side net fusions are sick. 1 in 16. Gold crown die cuts are 1 in 8. And stated... Okay, they reflect the averages. But I think there used to be like jerseys and stuff too. But these cards are nostalgic. We're going to go for some Hall of Famers is what we're after. And I uh, I wonder if these were like back in the day really easy to pack search out of retail products. And that like the odds of pulling or the chance of us pulling anything decent is like astronomically low. But we've got Matthias Oland. And back here, we've got... Chris Pronger, there's a nice Hall of Famer. And behind that, we've got Olaf Kolzing. And behind that, we've got, ooh, is that Ray Bork? Look at that. Nice Ray Bork in the prism, uh, prism base there. But a Hall of Famer nonetheless. He's going in our hits pile. And, oh, that's a blue one. So I think that's the blue variation. Yeah. Uh, and those were uh, every, every four packs you get a blue. Very sick. Okay. A nice hit, Olaf Kolzing. And our checklist of Matthias Olin, is that Vancouver? Oh, no, that's just in general. Player checklist. Cool. All right, getting into our third pack. We rolled a one. We're pulling this pack right away, and hopefully we can get Bedard out of this. You're going to see some of those cards on the screen. We can pull up his. Uh, anything Bedard would make my day. Let's see. Uh, ooh, we have a blue border and then uh, some retros, and then I think there'll be a short print. So we got Matthias Ekholm, Nick Paul, Cole Sillinger, there's Austin Matthews, Dominic Kubelik, Philip Hedl. Uh, I don't think this is our short print yet. There's Lafreniere. Uh, this is our short print, I think, a marquee rookie or a all-star. And it looks like it'll be a rookie. Is that Cooley? We got Logan Cooley, marquee rookie. That's one of the better ones to get. It is not Bedard, though, but there's a chance that Bedard's back here. No, Warrior 46. Is that like Suter? Uh, ooh, Spurgeon? Yeah, Jared Spurgeon in the retro there. And our blue border is 34. Is that Matthews? It is a nice color match of Austin Matthews in the blue border. That's sick. All right. All right, getting into our fourth pack, we roll the five. So we're going one, two, three, four and right back here is five it's eight oh, knocking over matthews it is ahl 2019-20 so we're uh, we're hunting for those autographs out of this uh and uh maybe even a sizzler sensation selfishly you can sometimes pull a university player out of this and that's my pc so it doesn't look like we've got an autograph but you never know we've got alexi heponiemi morgan geeky on andrew potterowski stefan nosen louis belpedio riley tufty troy grosnick Kiefer Bellows, and our insert's going to be Oilers at Broberg. Benson, Tyler Benson on uh, on the Condors there. Very cool. All right, getting into our fifth pack. Still nothing too crazy yet. One, two, and three. We've got another Austin Matthews hunt. I believe this is one of the final T Team Canada Juniors packs we have in our, in our box here. Uh, and we are looking for something thick there. Doesn't look like it. Let's see. Ooh, looks like a big decoy. Oh, but we do have a jersey, it looks like. So there is uh, there is something semi-thick. So we'll pull from the back. We've got Zach Dean, prior to the program. And then we've got the big, thick decoy. And we're going after Bedard here. we got Cameron Allen on the red. And this is going to be a jersey. 
of 19. Oh, wow, Adam Fantilli. That's sick. I'll take it. Oh, and something on the back. 21, Program of Excellence, Nathan Gaucher. But look at this jersey card of Adam Fantilli. That's sick. I'm ha very happy to pick that up. 19 must be like the safest number for pulling decent names because I feel like in Canada, if you're wearing number 19, you you got to be a stud. Only, only like sick prospects wear 19. <laughs> uh, all right, getting into our six pack. We rolled a six. We're going one, two, three, four, five, and six. Ooh, wow. 98, 99 NHL hockey cards. Uh, top's finest refractor. You can see through it. The back card there is none other than Stevie Eiserman with six premium cards, it says. Uh, so I really don't know what to expect in these. They're all kind of pretty bizarre. I'll, pull, I'll peel from the bottom. Uh, they've all got like the protector plastic on them. And uh, in general, I don't really know what I'm looking for. So we're just going to have fun with this together. And uh, a little nostalgic product. We've got Danius Zubris. Uh, there's Steve Eiserman, and interesting on the back, they've got a different photo than the front, which I find always a nice touch. Uh, so Steve Eiserman's got uh, his close-up shot on the back, and Hall of Famer, so he's going there. And we got another Hall of Famer here. Look at this, Patrick Waugh. Wow, this is a very nice card. And uh, am I seeing something? That, oh no, I don't think so. I think these are all base cards. Is this, there's two cards sticking together here. We've got ooh, this is a refractor, I think, of Jeff Friesen. Uh, so Jeff Friesen, this might be a rookie too, if I'm not mistaken, the year. No, but look at this. Wow, look at the shine on this card. So yeah, it says up top there, Refractor. Uh, just a sick card. So I'm looking at the uh, the odds back here, and it's 1 in 12 for a Refractor, and then uh, no Protector. The It goes up. So no Protector is 1 in 4. So the Protectors are the base, and then without a Protector... There's less and less. So look, there's it's twice as hard to pull a refractor without the 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 protector. So this card without the protector is actually a one in twenty four pack. So it's like basically a box hit. Uh, the refractor here, very cool. And Jeff Friesen, I always remember him for as a Sens fan. The Devils, uh, the Devils beat us in the Stanley Cup uh, semis there, the Eastern Conference Finals, and. Um, I think he scored a pretty pivotal goal that year in the in that uh, in that series to push Devils to the finals, which was crappy for me. But then there's uh, Igor Korolev in this pack, and behind that we've got Carl Dykus or Dykus, Dykus, something like that, Dykus. Uh, but very cool, a couple of very interesting cards out of that. The refractor is sick. Uh, but we'll get into the last pack here, rolling a two. And we're going one and two, and we're ending with 23-24 Tims. Uh, the the new season of Tims just dropped, but we're still working our way through the old season of Tims. Uh, and you'll see some of the cards we're going after on the screen. There's, ooh, lightning in the background. It would be sick to get uh, a, a uh, what do you call it, uh, redemption. But uh, we'll see here. we got Dougie Hamilton on the back, Chris Letang on the front, and we got a cool insert. Oh, yes, Patrice Bergeron. Very nice one to get. Uh, in the Superstar Showcase. Uh, so that'll do it for the rip. We got some really interesting cards out of that. Very neat variety. Uh, some Hall of Fame content. That's always nice. Uh, but uh, the highlight for sure, the Adam Pantilli jersey card. Very nice. I'm happy with that one. If you did like that one, it helps us out if you leave a thumbs up. And if you want to see more stuff like that, uh, be sure to subscribe and keep bringing more content. Uh, but as always, thanks a lot for tuning in. Take care.